So I'm here in the in the park of Wheelock Village. I wanted to talk about this town and its interesting uh, secret. It's not really a secret. I guess it's just a, not a, a nationally known thing about Wheelock. Um, currently, the population of Wheelock is between eight and nine hundred people. Uh, definitely more dirt roads than paved roads. <laughs> you can see a cemetery behind me across the road. Um, the interesting thing here is the, the person the town was named after. In, uh, I think it was 1869. Well, you know what? There's a plaque. Let's go look at the plaque. This town is just a, just a little, it has a store, a country store, village store and gas pumps. Uh, I think we can read it here. Probably can't read it, sorry. But the, uh, the Dartmouth College land grant when Eleazar Wheelock. Eleazar, that's just a fun name to say. <laughs> in in uh, 1769 was, uh, the, the town was named after him. Um, he founded Dartmouth College, an Ivy League school down in uh, Hanover, New Hampshire. Uh, I think in uh, somewhere around that time frame, and uh, needed funds to fund the school. So he petitioned the state of Vermont. Vermont, in turn, granted them 23,000 acres in the town of Wheelock uh, to rent to people in 100-acre lots for for a fee and that money would in turn go to the college state of vermont even though dartmouth is in new hampshire saw it as a an important part of the area um, for education so that's how it went way back then um, his son john uh yeah john wheelock actually is the one was instrumental in getting a lot of that taken care of he John Wheelock later became president after his father, Eleazar, founded Dartmouth College. That's pretty amazing. So that's just a, a little kind of not very well known thing nationally about this little town uh, with all its quaintness. I'm going to take the drone up, look around, and so you can get an idea of, this, of the size of this town. All right. This little town does have a big surprise. If you uh, grew up here in Wheelock, you have the opportunity to go tuition free to Dartmouth College if you qualify for you know, academically. Uh, there have been, um, I don't know how many, 10 or 15 people that have grown up in the town of Wheelock that have been able to go to Dartmouth. Apparently there have been uh, a lot of people out of the area that have said, we would like to send our our daughter or son to Dartmouth and we're going to move to Wheelock can we get in tuition free and they they are turned down for that you have to kind of be it's a sort of a gray line of of how that stands but um, John Wheelock is the one that instituted that scholarship program so it's kind of fascinating a little co a little town like this and you can go to an Ivy League school tuition free if you qualify academically. See the village store there? Gas pumps, that's it. <laughs> that's Miller's Run Brook. And that's the town. Yeah, 
here in a helicopter overhead. Way out of my sight. Nice little cemetery. These fields are just very fertile from all of the silt that comes down out of the mountains, settles here in the valleys. These streams are so clear.